New reward, new island. So we did get a new island, and that's that's what is that, dude? Is that is that a cow? Oh my god, look at the cow! Welcome back everyone, my name is Echo, and I hope you're having an absolutely fantastic day. Today on my YouTube channel, we start a brand new Minecraft mini-series, and this is called Cobble Clicker. So this map is available for iOS, Android, Windows 10, Xbox, and Nintendo Switch. I want to do this series because between now and the full release of Village and Pillage, I do want to bring you a Let's Play Survival of the Village and Pillage update. So I hope you guys are going to fully enjoy this. Now you can do this on your own, like me, or you can do this with your friends and have a little bit of competition. So as you can see here, this is the map. It's called Cobble Clicker. I'll briefly read the details to you guys. Experience survival skyblock in a whole new way with Cobble Clicker. Start small with an island, then collect enough cobblestone to unlock rewards. Set up automated cobblestone crushers and mob grinders. Discover new mobs such as ore, sheep, and cobbled creepers. Play solo or with friends, co-op or versus mode. Compete for the top of the scoreboard, and it was created by Poly Maps. I think this is going to be super fun. So basically, the sheep can poop out ores, from what I understand about this. Now, a little bit of information about this series from me. Episodes will be releasing every single Monday. And every single Friday. This series will not have a face cam. I kind of wanted to try something a little bit different. And if you do enjoy this, please be sure to smash that like button. If we smash over 800 likes, I'll bring you guys a bonus episode. But without further ado, let's get into this. And today, we have became the Giraffe Echo. I'm no longer normal Echo. So, welcome to Cobble Clicker Skyblock. Step on a colored pad to choose a team. Join the same team to play co-op, join different teams to play versus. So you could do like a 2v2, you could do like a 1v1, or you could simply play survival like me and do it on your own. I'm My favorite color is red. I don't know what team you guys would pick. Let me know in the comment section. But we are team red. All right, so you'll notice on the right-hand side of the map, it has like cobblestone. So when you mine cobblestone, that number goes up and 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 up. Um, but it's a sky block with a twist and I know I've done sky trade before But I really enjoy sky trade and I think you guys will fully enjoy this as well I kind of don't want to break anything yet. So we do have ooh, We got some cookies. Yo, I'm taking these straight away. We've also got ah, a guidebook Okay, we'll take that and a leather cap. Well, we're gonna rock this. What do I look like? Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that Okay, so let's read the book Ah, page one of seven cobble clicker welcome human to cobble mining simulation Earn cobblestone currency in brackets C by obtaining cobblestone track your total cobblestone in the pause menu Your team will unlock rewards for each milestone reached you'll get a new island at five cobble You'll get the hub at 25 cobble you'll get items at 50 another island at 75 cobble Another item at 125 cobble, you will get island at 250 and at 500 cobble, item at 800, island at 1200, item at 1, okay, so it just goes on and on and on, so we go, oh my god, there is, you can actually collect 100,000 cobblestone. Once your team gains access to the hub warp, you'll be able to visit the hub. Here you can buy and sell various items, learn more about the different mobs and machines, and obtain another guidebook. You should, should you lose the, oh, okay, so you can buy, or you can get another guidebook in case we lose this one. Automation, to produce cobblestone at a faster rate, you are going to want to build more cobblestone generators and set up cobblestone crushers and mob grinders. Get creative with pistons, and you can create an automated mining setup. In the hub, you can change various game rules, such as keep inventory, phantom spawning, PvP, Difficult. Totem of Undying. The Totem of Undying is a powerful item that allows you to defy death, even in the event that you fall out of the world. If you have a Totem Undying anywhere in your inventory, when you fall, your, your Totem will teleport you back to safety. Okay, so for this world specifically, because it's just a sky block, Totem of Undying is going to be incredibly important. I do not want to lose that. I do not want to lose three cookies. Ooh, this is gonna be really interesting. Not quite sure what this thing does though. 
Maybe that just started the world, I don't know. So it's all about mining cobblestone. Of course, we're Minecraft players. First thing that we're gonna have to do here is hopefully we, we can get ourselves a sapling because in, in worlds like this, if we don't get a sapling, you're kind of screwed. So sapling to reproduce the wood. Don't forget you get apples and you get sticks from breaking down trees now. Not sure when this map was created, but first thing is first. Let's create ourselves a crafting table because we're gonna need one of them. We need a crafting table and I need a pick because it said at five cobble, you then get yourself, let's just do uh, a couple of these. I don't wanna waste too much of this. Um, at five cobble, we get a new island. So I guess we've got to mine a couple of cobble around here. So we will put you right there for now. Let's create ourselves a pick and let's mine a little bit of cobble. I gotta be really careful though because I don't want to fall through this world. You never know with this game. Oh look, the number goes up as well. So we've done two. Wait. Ah, so you do gotta pick it up. Wait. Oh. Okay, so instead of the, oh, we got, a, we got a stick. Instead of the cobble going inside of your inventory, it's on the right-hand side. So when you pick it up, it kind of disappears. Oh, that's actually really cool. I like that. All right, let's see if we can get ourselves a couple more. This is number four, and please don't fall through the world. I'll stand here just in case. Do we get it? Let's go. New reward, new island. So we did get a new island. Okay. Well, I don't think, Nick, I don't think they're going to spawn this commonly. I think we just got incredibly lucky. It's also becoming nighttime already, so that's not good. Also, we don't have ourselves a sapling yet. So first thing for me is I want to make sure we do have saplings because I want to make sure we can reproduce wood. Wood is good. Oh, we got two. Oh, that's, go that's a good start. All right, so this is your spawning island. Dude, this is going to be so much fun. I'm, I'm really excited to bring you guys a new mini series. I love Skyblock. Skyblock Survival Island. They are some of my favorite ever things to do. And we got ourselves a couple of sticks. Right, so we've got ourselves, we'll put that there. Um, and, hmm, should we put that? I guess we could put it there for now. All right, so first night time. I wanna go over there though. How much wood do we have? Um, should we make one, two, three, one, two, three, one. Now we will just make six for now. I don't wanna waste this wood because I, I don't know how often the trees are gonna spawn. Um, so let's get to the new island. Dudes, we have a new, it's a chicken. Oh my god, but what's wrong with the chicken? You okay, dude? Oh, oh it's a cobblestone generator too. Oh my god, okay. So this naturally spawned this, uh, hello. How you doing, little friend? Okay, so it said that we get animals. I got a feeling I don't want to kill this guy or injure him. So I'm gonna push him right in the corner. Nope, doesn't want, to, doesn't want to go in the corner. Right, so we get something else at 25 as well. So if we can grab ourselves 25 cobblestone, this is then going to take us, I think it was to the hub. I think you get a new island at five and then we get the new hub. And I'm kind of really curious behind the whole new hub because it says that we can buy and sell things. Okay, this chicken's proving a little bit of a problem because he doesn't stop moving. And every time I try and break one of these, He's in the water. I don't want him to get crushed because I got a feeling we're going to need this guy. Where's he gone now? There he is. All right. I'm just going to let him do his business. Okay, so we need 10 more of these. Okay, we've got 23. This is 24. One more is 25. We get a new, new island, right? New island. New island. New reward. New island. So we did get a new island and that's... that's what is that, dude? Is that, is that a cow? Oh my god, look at the cow. <laughs> he seems really affected. Okay, so chicken. Hello. <laughs> You're really, he's like he's living life on the Oh, this No. He died. <laughs> okay. Bye chicken. Dude, he was I don't know if that's me game over or what. I don't know what just happened. All right. Well, <laughs> I found a chest. We got some bow, ah, we got an iron pick as well, and a couple of saplings. All right, so a couple of things are gonna be dotted around. That's great. I can't believe, oh, I'm stuck. I can't believe we lost our chicken. I He was like, he was living life on the edge because he was living in the water and then pushing towards this. All right, well, we gotta get over there. Looks kind of like a hero Brian cow. I don't know if I could trust it or not. Uh, but let's quickly go back to our home island. Um, oh, we've got bones. Let's bone meal some of these trees. I hope we don't need this for something else, but we could do with bone mealing this. 
There we go. All right. So we're gonna, um, do I want to make an axe? Yeah. Yeah, we'll make an axe. For the sake of this, we'll make an axe because I, I, we're going to probably have to do a couple of these. Right, so we'll chop this down because I'm going to need some more wood because we're, we're going to need to get to the hub. Getting to the hub for me is the main thing because I, I kind of want to see what, what's what's over there. Same time though, we are going to need one or two saplings. Actually, we're not really desperate on saplings because we got a couple of them. Um, I kind of don't want to bone meal that one just yet. So let's take down this tree and see if we get ourselves any more ingredients. Okay, so we didn't quite get three or four or five saplings, but I got my sapling back. Plus, I've still got these two as well. Uh, let's put this inside of here. All right, so I'm going to use this pick first. Got a little bit of food. My food hasn't started going down. Got this as well. This can go over here. Okay, we're starting to get a couple of things done. Let's just make uh, six of these. Is six going to be enough to get over there? For some reason, that cow is kind of really creeping me out, dudes. Let's just extend this. That's obviously not going to be enough, so we're going to have to make a couple more, right? So, let's go to one, and we'll make one more. Six? Is six going to be enough? Well, hopefully. I, at the start of any skyblock, like Survival Island, you gotta you got to save your resources. That's going to really annoy me if I do it that way. And I'm going to lose some pieces, aren't I? All right, well, for the time being, it's just going to have to be like this. Hello, almighty cow. Who are you? What do you do? Oh, uh, like, you? oh my mm. god, he's... Dude, why is all these animals trying to get themselves killed? He looks so cool, though. He really does. Right, so I think this is the hub. Let's just double check if there's anything else on this island, though, because the other island definitely did. Oh, there's a chest. Oh, there's the chicken. He didn't die. Okay. The little chicken nugget's still fine. <laughs> um, there's a chest over there as well. Dude, he's right there. Of course he is. Oh, my days. All right, well, I don't, I don't see anything. Let's go, let's go to this. So this takes us to what is called... The hub. So you've got help, shop, sell, and warp. My guess is warp is back home. Let's have a quick look inside of here, because this is probably going to tell you... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Does that tell you what the cow is? Element cow. Ice element cows can be milked for an ice bucket. <gasps> oh, dude, that is awesome. All right, what about the chicken? Stone chicken. Stone chickens will period periodically lay a block of stone. But when bred together, they will lay an egg. Oh my god, dude, look at these animals, man! This guy is the elemental cow, magma. Magma elemental cows can be milked for a lava bucket. Look how cool they look, though, dude. They look awesome. The next one. This is ore sheep. Spawn with a random ore variant. They will drop their ores when sheared and can regrow their ores by eating grass. Look at him! Can you please drop me some ores now? Dude, he's, he's, he's made out of diamond. That's awesome. What's this? Mob grinder. Okay, let's read this. Mob grinders produce cobblestone. Currency. See. From mobs that fall into the item drops. From mobs will pass directly through. Gotta read that again. The machine, meaning a hopper can be placed below to catch items. Machines cannot be used in other dimensions. Oh, dude, they used the old school stone cutter and turned it into a grinder. That's so cool. Ooh. Oh my god, look at this one. Okay, so this one's a cobble crusher. Cobble crusher, produce cobblestone currency. By crushing cobblestone blocks that are placed on top, machine cannot be used in other dimensions. Oh my god. So I think we have to buy these, right? I I'm, I'm guessing though. Who is this guy? Hello. Let's speak to him. Well, oh, oh, let's grab this. Welcome to help section. Here you can read about the various special mobs and machine, change game rules, or even change your team. Okay, so we've already, oh, we've got ourselves an extra, an extra book. Thank you very much. This is team selected. Uh, there's so many things going on. Uh, ah, okay, so that's kind of an example of how it works. Oh my god, this is going to be so much fun, dude. This is going to be so much fun. Ah, so you can change your, your details in here. Keep inventory on or off, phantom spawning on or off, PvP on or off, difficulty, uh, I'm guessing on or off. What's this one then? Uh, water source. Ah, so this is teaching you how to make yourself the cobblestone generator. Yo, this is absolutely awesome. So this is the hub, so this is where we've all got to learn. Uh, oh, okay. So, oh my god. Oh, it's cobblestone. Dude, this is so cool. It's the cobble machine and it goes through there. Wait, does it go through here? It goes through here. Oh, there it is. Then does it go over here? I'm guessing it kind of goes through here, and then does it come out here? 
And then I, I, I don't know what the robots are doing. They're just having some kind of fun. Okay, so that was help, that's shop, that's sell, and that's something else. Right, so we can sell, we can sell, 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 sell. We can sell things. So we can sell rotten flesh equals 10 cobble. Rocky potato, ooh, that looks pretty cool, equals 25 uh, cobble. A cake equals 250, so that's going to take some time to get. Okay, so obviously this is the, the selling section. Welcome to the cobble exchange. Here you can sell specific items in exchange for cobblestone currency. To sell an item, stand on a pressure plate and press the button. We can, ooh, gold block is only 100 cobble. Emerald block is 250 and diamond is 500. All right, so we got to work towards getting all of these. That's the warps. This is the shop. So there's things that we can buy. We can buy dirt for 25 cobble, stone for 25 cobble, 50, uh, sand for 50, gravel for 50, clay for 50, sapling. Ah, so we can get saplings. Whew. So we don't got to worry. If we lose our saplings, we're all good. Uh, ooh, furnace. We could buy a furnace. Ah, so we are going to have to buy a furnace eventually. Pistons, who is this guy? Welcome to the cobble shop. Here you can exchange cobble currency for items to buy an item. Stand under pressure. Okay, I already know that. We could buy the Elytra for 5,000 cobble. Mob grinder for 2,000. Cobble crusher for 1,000. Totem of dying is 500. Ah, so we can start buying the, the actual mobs. Ore sheep, 400. Elemental cow, 200. 200 for the forest pig and 100 for the stone chicken. Right, so that makes a little bit more sense now. I'm probably going to have to come back in here a couple of times. Let's go back to... Hello, hello there, beautiful. So, um, if we milk this cow, I believe it said it gives us water or ice. Which might be good for like an infinite water source. Right, so I think that... I think what we need to do now is I need to kind of just secure this area a little bit. I kind of want to see what's inside of that chest as well, but I don't trust myself to get down there. I, I just don't trust myself just yet. Um, we could... Oh, my tree grew. Perfect. Right. I've also noticed, though, on the island... I'm gonna... Do I have, a, do I have any slabs left? I, I, just, I feel like I'm gonna fall there. I noticed on my island and the other island that there is iron. And I do have a... I do have a gold... Wait. What, did I not pick up the iron? Does gold not break gold? Does break... What? I'm confused. I'm slightly confused here. Either way, we're going to have to take this down. There is so much to take in with this world. There's so much to learn and there's so much to do. But I love it. I love the more complex things. Because now you got to be really smart on, on what you do. Like where you spend your things and how you spend your currencies. I think the cobblestone generator is going to be really important. So we look at the book again. Let's have a quick look at this book. So we look at this book. 50 is an item. So we need to try and get ourselves 50. And I've got a gold, gold pick. So I think we'll use this to start off with. Let's get ourselves to 50, because I'm kind of really curious as to what the item is going to be. All right, so I'm on 45. My uh, wooden pick's about to break soon as well. 46. I just thought we could use the rest of the durability of this. I noticed, though, that so many pieces end up going inside of the, uh, the lava. So 47. 48. 49. And one more. I believe it said new item at 50. New reward, new item. Ah, we got ourselves a stone pick. Right. So, we should, I just want to go this way, be able to take, take you out, take the iron, I believe now. Maybe we couldn't do it previously. And that's great, isn't it? That's, that's, that's great. That, <laughs> that's great, guys. It, oh, man, it now belongs to the, the bottom. There's, there's nothing I could do. Plus, I don't have, um, I don't have a furnace. We need to keep getting a couple more trees because I need to secure this island a little bit more. There is so much to do. I never realized that we got to do so much of this. Right, so let's just quickly take down this tree. We got a couple of sticks. That's a good thing though. I don't mind getting sticks from this because it saves me using the wood that we chopped down the trees for. We get sticks in return. We're also going to need ourselves some sheep as well because we're going to need to sleep in this. I think phantoms are going to be a little bit of a pain. Right, so let's grab... Uh, we'll convert all of these and I'm going to turn these into this. Because I just want to secure this this area a little bit more. I feel a bit safer if things are kind of doubled up. Plus, if we... Oh, yeah, mobs are going to spawn, right? That's going to be interesting. Right, so we do this. Just, just feel a little bit more safer. 
Don't gotta worry then about falling off the island. And since we're gonna start taking away some... Wait, I wonder if there's any secret chests in this island. We should probably do a little bit of digging inside of this island. I'll, I'll keep some of the... I think it's coarse. We'll keep some of these blocks. Others we can convert anyway. Hey, we got a stick. I just wanna know if there's gonna be anything inside of here. Because with things like this, there's usually... There's usually a couple of hidden things. I don't think there's gonna be anything hidden inside of this one though. Oh, okay. I was wrong. I knew there'd be something on this island. Right, so let's... Uh, I think is, I, I gotta be really careful. We got <gasps> seeds, food. Okay, food is gonna be all, always really, really good. I just realized though, guys, I'm, I gotta be really, really smart because um, I don't really got much... We, don't, we can't use cobble, can we? I mean, I, I think we can buy cobble or buy stone. I gotta be really, 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 really resourceful here. Because if I dig my island out, then I'm not gonna have blocks to get myself back up. So, we'll just put down... No, not like that. We'll put down a couple of these. Then we can kind of start to form the island a little bit more. I can't wait to start getting those those generators. This way everything's kind of on one level. Because I, I really don't want to fall down there. Actually, it's only a chest. It's not, it's not a bad thing. Uh, also, saplings, I feel like wood's going to be a big thing for me in this as well. And I think the next unlock that we get is possibly at 100. Do we get torches then? Yeah, we did. So we will quickly do one and two. And I'm going to put one on the bridge as well. I'm not saying things are going to spawn straight away, but they, they will begin to spawn at some point. Right, so let's kind of secure this. Just so this, this tree can also start to grow. I've got bone meal, so I could just put... Oh, I wasted, I wasted that. I'm not going to get rid of it yet, though. All right, so that's, that can grow. We've got two saplings officially. I'm gonna move this. Um, I think there's, all right, how many saplings have I got on me? That can go there. How much bone meal have I got on me? Eight, all right. So let's kind of grow you, if, yes. And let's grow you, if you will. All right, absolutely perfect. All right, two trees. Let's knock them down. Okay, so both of them are knocked down. I've now got even more saplings. I can't, is there a, oh, so they do grow on there, okay. All right, well, we're not going to put that there for a start. We'll put one here. Um, one can go there, one can go there, and I guess one can go there, and we'll break this as well. All right, do I have any dirt on me? Yeah, I do. So the more dirt we have, the more buildings, should I say more trees that we can start to build, the more we can start to extend our island. Now, I do have a stone pick, also a gold one as well. I'm going to break the rest of this. I think if we look at my book, I think we need to get 100. 75 is also a new island as well. Okay, so let's get ourselves to 75. Because also I'm going to start to need to start buying some dirt. Because we are going to need... We are really going to need uh, food. I've only got three of these cookies and three more inside of there. I've not had a single apple yet. So let's get ourselves some more cobble first. So this is going to produce a new island at 75. The new island produced is oh my god i'm on fire let's just quickly cool down oh that's bad because now my food's gonna start to shake a little bit uh, anyway we do have ourselves a new island and this island looks way more luxurious compared to these ones so these are the starting ones oh it is i think that might be a piggy as well but ladies and gentlemen we're gonna end today's first episode there come and join along with me the map is absolutely brilliant and i think they've done a real good job and i'm looking forward to bringing you guys Many more episodes. Any tips? Because some of you might have already played this before. Leave them in the comment section and I will catch you every single Monday and every single Friday for a brand new episode. Catch you next time. Bye.